Welcome to Concept Control's YouTube channel. This video will cover a hands-on demonstration of the Ray Systems LP1200 hand pump. This hand pump is a simple and affordable way to get a rough idea on what gas concentrations are using colorimetric tubes. For your convenience, we have attached a couple pages from our catalog in the description below. This should help you find the correct part number when selecting your tubes. First, gently open up the pack of tubes. You can cut along the perforated edge to make things easier. Pull out one of the tubes. The hole located on the side of the pump near the inlet is the tube breaker. Place each end of the tube into this hole and break the tips off. Loosen off the pump inlet nut. Take note of the arrow on the tube to get the correct orientation. This arrow should point towards the pump inlet. Insert the tube until it bottoms out. Tighten the pump inlet nut until the tube is held securely in place. Depending on the gas you're trying to sample and the range that you're looking for will determine the number of pump strokes. In this case it says right on the package to use one full stroke and it will take two minutes to perform the sample. On this particular pump there is a marker on the side of the pump body where you can set the counter to remind you how many pump strokes you need to take. The dot on the handle and the dot on the body of the pump need to be lined up. The dot on the handle will also have a 50 or 100 on it. If you have it on 50, that means that it will only take a half draw stroke. If you have it on 100, it will take a full draw stroke. Once we have it set to 100, grip the pump handle and give it a strong pull until the handle is fully extended. The handle should lock fully extended. If the handle is getting pulled back into the pump unit, you either didn't pull it far enough or you don't have those dots on the handle and the body lined up. With the handle fully extended, your sample time begins. To determine if your sample is complete, Look at the bottom of the pump handle. If it's clear, the sample is still in progress. If it's white, then the sample is complete. For additional pump strokes, rotate the handle quarter turn left or right and push it back fully without removing the tube from the pump. Repeat the draw cycle. When complete, loosen the pump inlet nut and remove the tube. Be sure to read the tube immediately after air sampling as the color may change, fade, or disperse over time. Also, Check the data sheet supplied with each box of tubes and apply any correction factors for the temperature or humidity. Multiply the observed reading by the correction factor to obtain the true value. Thank you for watching. Please take a moment to like and share the video. You can also connect with us on Facebook, Twitter, and follow us on LinkedIn via the video description below. Want to be the first to know when a new video is released? Click subscribe and get notifications directly to your inbox. We're also available if you need more information. Visit www.conceptcontrols.com and give us a call today.